There are thousands of Blender add-ons on Blender Market, ranging from a dollar all the way to $400,000. But there's not a single video showing all the free ones in one place. So I got a list and there's some insane stuff on here, like RC cars, instant burns, and even a realistic ragdoll simulator. But that begs the question, what are the best free Blender add-ons? And to answer that, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try every free Blender Market add-on. I'm already losing my mind, bro. I'm gonna be here for hours. I wanna test this, but I literally can't. <laughs> I am going to snap my computer screen in half. <laughs> Before we begin, we need to define what an add-on is. A third-party tool to extend Blender's functionality or simplify a workflow. I actually have a list of Blender add-ons that Blender Market gave me specifically. Surprisingly enough, the total of this actually comes out to exactly 73 add-ons. It seems like not a lot, but it's actually a ton. <laughs> so I'm going to download these now. What am I doing with <laughs> After successfully downloading all 73 add-ons, it was time to start. Okay, kid ops, you're installed. But as time went on, I can choose what I want to do. So throw it on the face. This was going to be more boring than I initially thought. <laughs> it's basically a kit bashing asset pack. <laughs> Boomerang for Sculptors Infinite Update. Let's check this out. First of all, this one actually looks really fun and cool. You can draw sculptures from curves. The only problem is for some reason, this is currently <laughs> unavailable. And this is the case for like six, maybe seven add-ons. I don't know why. It's, it's actually really sad after trying the dud add-ons and many that were less than ideal okay, is this really it <laughs> we finally made it to the one i was most excited about ragdoll dynamics okay this one i'm excited about so how do i do this i need to download ragdoll core uh yep accept install i could be installing a virus i just accepted anything and every what is this <laughs> Give me the virus. So I think the easiest and fastest way for me to test this would be a Mixmo model. And while Smeef's figuring out this insane add-on, how do I get this working? <laughs> I want to tell you about Brilliant. It's the best place to learn by doing with thousands of lessons on things like science and maths. Okay, assign and connect. Boom. What if I hit play right now? <laughs> Why is his... Yonkia. Okay, so that's his body. Brilliant is the most effective way to learn. Instead of a boring lecture, you get interactive, gamified lessons. Each concept builds into the next, so you feel smart while having fun. Plus, it's literally built like a video game, with things like XP, level progression, even daily streaks. So, Ragdoll, is this working how I think it's working? I think so. This is definitely wrong. Let's record the simulation. Oh my God. Brilliant actually has a course on coding, which is how any of this works. Understanding core concepts like loops and variables is essential for making add-ons or even just a simple geometry node setup. This course teaches you all about that. Um, okay. Let's do a forward jump. That seems good. Let's just attempt <laughs> to record this. What the f That's awesome. If you want to try Brilliant out, click the link below or go to brilliant.org forward slash smeef for a free 30 day trial. It's literally free. You'll also get 20% off your first annual subscription. Click that link and thanks to Brilliant for sponsoring this video. Ragdoll Dynamics. Done. With 15 add ons completed, I found there were mainly two types of add ons either extremely simple ideas, instant image baker, baked with literally one click lazy rename that's it add on for creating wiggle i mean yeah he's wiggling or free to use quality of life tool so so it's like a custom pie menu in blender with paid assets it's a free add-on that does nothing you gotta pay for all this wait maybe this is gigabrain right now all it <laughs> all it does is open a new window bro i'm not on a roll with these today <laughs> Uh, not only was I not on a roll, but there was a serious problem. Now it's time for add-ons with the zero dollar variant. And oh, I was taking way too long to test each of these. That wasn't even, it was barely 20 add-ons. 
and I've been recording for three hours. Something had to change. So on day two, I came up with a genius idea. So this time I've got a speed run timer and I'm gonna try and get this done in three hours. So, I mean, the minute that thing hits three hours, I'm, I'm out. And I didn't know it yet, but this was about to be the most frustrating three hours of my life. Starting, uh, now. Uh, this is embarrassing. So this just doesn't work. Mm, uh, that's wrong. Where's the mesh? <laughs> what is going on? The problem wasn't installing or using the add-ons. It was understanding how they work. Alt tab alumna. How do I use this add-on? This is actually going to send me insane. Why is it not working? And for some, the only documentation they had was literally a 20 um, minute video. I need to look at the video. Hello everyone and welcome. Oh my God. <laughs> That was so loud. At this stage, I tested roughly 50 add-ons and after five hours of recording, I began to notice a pack. I have a feeling this is an asset pack. It's an asset pack. Oh, it's an asset library. Okay, asset pack. Most of these were just asset packs. I love asset packs. <laughs> or they were extremely similar to one another. All right, one click naming for baking. I feel like we did this at least twice last night. This is kind of like the simulation one I did earlier. Okay, another render animation timer. And with 40 minutes left on the clock, I was starting to feel the pressure. Let's just give it the best we can. But then the worst thing that could happen, happen. Let's, let's fucking speed through this. Okay, let's go. <gasps> Wait, what? God, no, <laughs> no. I know it doesn't seem like a big deal. I can't fix it. But to me at the time, this ruined my progression. I'm losing my mind and all momentum here. <sighs> and it honestly killed my motivation to keep going. Why did it do that? I was going through it, but I wasn't giving up that easy. Let's, okay, the meme was good. Let's just get rid of it. Especially since I finally made it to one of the funnest add-ons on this um, list. Oh my God, I'm so excited for this one. Is this what I think it is? Yes. Okay, it's an RC car add-on. Only problem is I couldn't get it to work. Ad rig, whoa, ad rig. What is wrong with it? And after 30 minutes of struggling, something I'm missing, do I need to add it to something that I've made or like what? I finally figured it out. I got it working. Check this out. Yeah! You can control it with a controller, but you have to have the pro version for that. Let's make it go crazy. Pump everything to the max. Let's see it. <laughs> and I don't remember doing this, but for some reason, I was excited for it and it, it did not disappoint. I started ranking them. S tier, perhaps? I'd put that in S tier. S. S plus. A tier. F tier. And after 10 straight hours of testing, why am I ranking these? When did I start ranking these? I started to forget why I was doing this. I mean, the whole goal for this video is to just find the best free Blender add-ons and show them. So with that in mind, I think it's time for a tier list. Stop Mo, a one-click solution for creating stop motion animation. <laughs> That is sick. S plus. Bone Dynamics, a realistic physics simulator for averages. My dude is working out right now. Look at this. <laughs> I'm clearly doing it wrong, but at the same time, I think I'm doing it right. S. Blend Rig, a super functional rig with an insane amount of features. Pick up. Dude, this is kind of mind blowing for a free add on. S. Block Blender. This literally turns anything into Minecraft blocks. Joey, what, what am I doing wrong? Including Smeef. That's what Smeef looks like in Minecraft. I love this add-on. The free one doesn't do it justice. <laughs> S tier. Now, I know what you're thinking. Smeef, that is a tiny tier list. What about the other 70 add-ons you tested? Well, a lot of these were either outdated. Am I reading that right? It's only available for Blender 2.8, 2.81 and 2.82, not working. It doesn't work. Um, I'm not gonna waste any more time on it. <laughs> or just straight up useless. I don't, I'm really not getting anything from these. Like some of them are opening up my eyes, but some of them are closing them. But 
after 10 straight hours of testing, this was me at the beginning of the challenge. This is me now and completely destroying my blender build. My blender is fucked up. <laughs> This is crazy. I finally made it to the end of the list. All right, last but not least, lazy bones. Let's see what this is about. A free add-on for converting armatures into renderable mesh objects. <laughs> I'm done. <laughs>